everybody, I'm Amy. I'm Dan. We're the Hustle Couple coming at you today with what's sold on eBay and Poshmark. <laughs> Yes, welcome, welcome, welcome. Hi. I think there's a couple new people. What? Every Hi. day, a few, which is great. What slow are we... and steady. Slow and steady, that's right. Uh, we're full time resellers out of Dallas, Texas. We sell on eBay, Poshmark, and Mercari primarily. Yeah. We have about 16 things going out, and as always, if anything comes in while we're filming, we'll pull it and ship it. And then at the end of our videos, we show you how much profit we made on the goods sold. Yes. We think that's a really important piece of watching YouTube. Let's um, make it worth your time. Yeah. You get the real the real numbers here. All right. So All we're right. going to start with Poshmark, I guess. Yeah, huh? let's do it. Uh, this dress. So I, I say it a lot on here, but shirt dresses do really well for us. And Club Monaco is having a moment. I don't know why. <laughs> All the Club Monaco in our closet leaves as soon as we list it. And that has not always been the case. We've nope. been reselling for four or five years now. And Club Monaco is a slow go. Uh, it's a Ralph Lauren brand. It's got its own store and a lot of malls. And this one mm -hmm. is a black shirt dress. It's go. wool. It's a wool blend. Let's make sure we don't have any looks like strays. We, right. Looks like we got it for $1.99. Yeah, we need to unroll this puppy. Okay. Um, and yeah, a dollar nine Club Monaco, the thrifts don't really price it up where we live. So if you see it, maybe grab it and do a little test. A little test. Here you go. All right. And that sold for $42. It is a high end brand. It's, it's like a little more high end than Zara. I think, um, I'm trying to find like it's equivalent. It's probably on the Eileen Fisher level, but it's made for a younger demographic in my opinion and it's a little bit edgy but really really classic cuts and classic styles kind of like all saints but maybe a little more preppy okay i'm pulling it out here i'm trying to describe <laughs> this brand to you yeah uh it's not hey. quite as preppy as j crew it's a little more edgy in my opinion and but the price points kind of like all saints a lot of leather jackets all saints is much more edgy but it's a happy medium there. It's professional wear work that you can wear to work. A lot of their stuff is professional. Um, and it's just got some really nice fabric and some design details that you may not see in your everyday, like lower end brands. So we pick it up. The men's stuff also does well. They have a men's and a women's. And um, the men's stuff is like suiting, but it has like a little stretch in it normally, or it'll be like a cable knit sweater that has a little alpaca in it. It's kind of like that. And I think, <laughs> I think that if we kind of, as a group, all here, focus on fabric content, our reselling will level up. I think you're right about that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Because fabric content equals quality, and quality equals things that people want to buy, because they're going to last a long time. So I like to sell things for $42. Do you? Yes. Let's do it. <laughs> All right. All right, and the next thing that's sold on Poshmark is in the box under here. Oh my gosh, this is going to Ruth. I bought this for myself on Mercari, and I used it, and now I'm giving it to Ruth because she bought it. Nice. Thank you. Thank you for all the birthday wishes. They are very well received. We had a good day yesterday. This. That. Um, this is Moschino. I love this one. You guys know I love stars though, right? This is Moschino. <laughs> it's from the fragrance line. And it's, um, you know, like a little purse or a makeup bag or pouch or whatever you... I love Moschino as a brand. Some of you might say Moschino because that's how it's spelled, but it's an Italian name and it is Moschino. So we're just gonna upgrade our pronunciations today. <laughs> and this is cute. It's very nice. You can store all of your collectibles in this lovely bag. I love anything celestial like this. Did you guys watch the Met? I mean the, um, yeah, well, the Met Gala was last night. 
and it was there paying homage to Karl Lagerfeld, who's a designer, and he passed away. And I was ready for some cats. Because <laughs> a lot of Karl Lagerfeld's novelty designs have to do with cats. And he has a cat that has an Instagram, and everybody's obsessed with his cat. Yes. And we <laughs> love cats. So I was so into this. I was like, it's my birthday. It's the Met Gala. There's going to be cats. It, it was going to be good. You know who did not disappoint? Jared Leto. Mm-hmm came as a cat like the full-on like a cat with fur eyes (laughs) like a mascot that would run around a football stadium that's what he showed up in and i was like (laughs) slow clapping i am all doja cat dressed up like a cat like from cats the musical cats like that kind of a cat yeah there was a lot of cats to be had uh i thought there were some iconic looks jared leto won though yeah he He was the cattiest cat (laughs) Did not disappoint. Understood the assignment. Yes. You see what I'm saying? Okay. <laughs> the Moschino sold for $16. If that was a Moschino, like, actual bag or purse, it could have gone for a lot more. Yeah. Okay. Okay. But that's a perfect... I think that. I think that's what I paid for it on Mercari. Something around there. All right. All right. Here are our eBay sales. We have 14 going out, Ooh. and two of them are flawed, and that is just... I'm going to talk about it till I can't talk about it anymore. Yes. Listing flawed merchandise. This is an Eileen Fisher cardigan organic linen mm-hmm. cotton button front white tiny flaw. This also went to Ruth. It's slubby slubby. That is a slub knit for sure. I don't even know what the tiny flaw is. You when I say tiny flaw. I don't either. I always mean tiny. Don't, don't get it twisted. <laughs> like. If I say tiny flaw, we should be like, where's the flaw? That's But that's what we're doing. We're doing that right now. I have no idea. There might be a little on the back of an arm or something, a little spot. So thank you, Ruth, for purchasing this for $28. Very, very much. Thank this you. This is the first Eileen Fisher cardigan I've ever seen with like little buttons like that. Hmm. We, normally they're open. So I'm pretty excited to find a button front one. Yep. Um, and since we do have new people, I'll just say it again. We didn't ever used to list flawed merchandise if there was a little spot on it i would try to get it out if i couldn't get it out it went back to goodwill and now we have a different approach because of a lot of the environment being one (laughs) and not wanting to send clothes to the landfill i think going to the bins has really opened our eyes for sure to how much waste there is we went to the bins two days last week which is a lot for us and i just couldn't believe we're, you know, we're skimming the cream off the top. For sure. But all of that stuff just goes into a landfill. Yeah, it's no bueno. All the Shein, all the H&Ms, the Banana Republics, although some of it we did buy and try to save. There's just so much Forever 21, Faded Glory. I cannot. Yep. Thousands and thousands of pounds. Just what we could see right then at that day. But that's like that every day every single day at all the bins all across the country <laughs> how much <laughs> yeah no let's not think about it too much well we have decided dan and i we're kind of like i don't know if you noticed we're like upgrading our clothing and we're trying to just be more cognizant and more aware and buy clothes that are going to last and clothes that fit us and we're buying from the thrift yes and we're just trying to make a big change and we're trying to have less but of higher quality and things that we love speaking of things that we love we love this brand that sold and of speaking of high quality yeah this is a super super nice uh, men's sport coat from brioni if you don't know brioni you really need to it's like super high-end italian and very expensive this is something we would consider paying up for. For sure. We did not. No, I found a whole bunch of Brionis at the thrift one time. These were $4.80 a piece. Doesn't that make you want to thrift every single day? <laughs> like, what are we missing right now? I know, right? Like, Sunday, I, we, I found a little Brunello Cuccinelli top stuffed in the very bottom corner of a bin that was about to be wheeled out to the to the forever. This is the second zone. time we've saved Brunello Cuccinelli <laughs> from the bo- the... What'd you say? Goodbye zone. But I don't remember what I said. But it, it, we yeah. again, the, a, car- a pair of khaki pants got saved right before they took it away from me. They were like, "Ma'am, you need to move." And I was like, "No, no! <laughs> grab them." <laughs> if you don't know Brunello Cuccinelli, that's another one to put in your mind map because 
That Dang. stuff is super expensive and you can command a really good dollar for it, but it does take a while to sell. Yep. This Brioni men's eight, uh, 48 long recent suit jacket, gray, 100% wool, Colossi, Colossa, two button jacket vented. Ooh, that was a mouthful. That, was a rough one. that sold for $201. Yes. Plus shipping. We charge shipping on everything. So, and I, we did have this listed way higher, like almost, I think, 380 or something like that. Mm -hmm. But we did have it listed for a really long time. And it's, it's a 48 long, which is not the most common size. Sure. Um, so when somebody throws a $200 offer in my face, I'm going to take it. <laughs> Every time. All right. This is 11.6. Uh, Is he calling me? Leander, Texas? Could be. Excuse me. Hello? Hi, this is she. Just, just say, I'm really sorry, I can't talk to you right now. Just say, I'm sorry, I can't talk to you right now. I gotta go by click. Oh, I'm very sorry. Just, here, here, just, here. Yeah, I'm, sorry. I'm very, very sorry. I can't, I don't have time to talk to you right now. I'm sorry. So. <laughs> Yo, I, I'm waiting on a call from a pharmacy. Normally I wouldn't answer during a YouTube video. I don't know what to do. I get paralyzed. I'm like, I mean, this person's just doing their job, right? I know. Yeah. They're just doing their job. But and I feel just bad. Just going, just on, on script. Just, do, 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 do. I couldn't even get a word in. I didn't, ma'am, I'm filming a YouTube video, like, right now. Like, right now. Yeah. And she was very lovely, and she was from the Human Rights Campaign, which I do support, and I felt bad. I still feel bad. <sighs> Can't people just send an email? I know, right? God. <laughs> Okay, the right. next is another really high-end, great brand to resell and very high quality. Max Mara is the brand. Uh, this is one of their offset brands, Max Mara mm. Weekend. Made in Italy, all the signs of quality. For sure. Women's size medium, red international button top, fitted viscose. So this, the things that make this top really, really nice, what size was this? A medium. So. Your Italian stuff that's a size medium is normally going to run smaller, but people buying this know that, yep. in my experience. They, they're not just randomly buying a Max Mara shirt on eBay. Uh, these lines right here are really, really nice. This means that this is cut to be really fitted on the figure. This would look fantastic under a suit. It's not going to get all bubbly and billowy, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So I think this this dress shirt is, and it's also got these beautiful box pleats on the sleeves. Like there's all these little details that make it fantastic. Um, What's he got? Yeah, so this is like a princess seam, kind of like a dart situation. This shirt is super stretchy. <laughs> it's made of viscose, which yeah. which can be a cheaper alternative, and a lot of cheap lines use it. But this viscose feels real nice. Oh, it's, well, it's cotton. It's cotton, viscose, and, and uh, 4% elastane. And 4% is a lot. A so. lot. Yeah. So when you put this on, it's going to fit like a glove. And it's going to flatter all the right places because the people that make these high-end clothing, the pattern makers, are skilled craftspeople. And that's what we need to think about when we're looking at these clothes, like the cut of them. You know when you walk into Forever 21 and you try on something, it's all off? <laughs> You know what I mean? Like the, <laughs> the fit, the proportions, a lot of times it's off because a skilled craftsperson that's dedicated their lives in a fashion house hasn't made that pattern, right? right, right. <laughs> a skilled person made this pattern. I can guarantee you when whoever puts this on, it's going to fit like a glove. Not a fourth grader with a you know, <laughs> cut, cut by number. Yeah, <laughs> and that's, that's what you're paying for. And people that get that, they start looking better, they start dressing better. And if they can get a deal on eBay, they're going to come find your stuff in your store. This sold for $35, which Sweet. I think is a great deal for the buyer. It's a great deal for us because we paid a couple bucks for it. One. Excuse me. We paid one buck for <laughs> it. And it's everybody wins. And it's not going to the landfill. Yep. High quality stuff going to the landfill will be keeping me up at night for the foreseeable future. Come on, now. 
These zippers are no good. Zipper bags are no good. 10 by 12, get the ones with the good zippers. Don't, don't, <laughs> don't scrimp. Skimp. Skimp. Yeah. Skrimp? How skimp. Do you say? Skimp. Okay. Max Mara Top. Six ounces. Next. Another mm. high end brand. Anne Fontaine. Right. Size 44, which equates to a US 12 Liverpool crinkle stretch button top blouse. Tiny flaw. Another tiny flaw. Yes. Um, Love selling Anne Fontaine, similar to Max Mara, similar quality, similar here's the, here's aesthetic. The tiny flaw on the sleeve. That's probably not gonna. A little bit of a yellowing. This is another very stretchy top that's gonna fit like a glove. Yep. It's, it's not the same color. buyer, but you would think that it might be. Uh, Anne Fontaine is known for her white button down shirts of all different styles, and it's, this is a crinkle fabric. So it's really cool. Mm -hmm. And when you wear it, it just, it, it, it's very flattering, okay? You don't see any lumps or bumps or like bra straps or anything like that because there's so much texture. So that's like a little bit of a, a hack if you're trying to conceal any shapewear or anything like that is to wear something that's textured. And this is very stretchy. So when you look at it, it doesn't look like a size 12, but when you put it on, it conforms to your proportions. That sold for $34.95, even with a tiny flaw. Love it. Excellent. Going to Long Beach. Long Beach, man. So much of our stuff has been going to Long Beach recently. It's it's a little bit. Maybe it's a sign. We should go to Long Beach. We should go to Long Beach. Yeah, we looked at houses in Long Beach. <laughs> Woo! We were psycho. 12 ounces. We had the car, the rental car. And we were in Long Beach and we were like, let's, let's just, just yeah. Zillow this. <laughs> just go to an open house. Ooh, yeah. There was only one open house, but it was like super nice like we can't right. afford long beach it was like right on the water though it was so nice so nice. y'all should we do a gofundme so <laughs> we okay the next is another high-end brand so nice uh it's an offset brand but it's still very very high-end this is missoni but this is the m missoni line so that it's made for younger people and um it's a little bit less quality but it's still very high quality. it's it's like max morrow weekend the yeah. same um, M. Missoni Women's Size Small 4 US 40 EU Striped Cardigan Sweater Multi. There you go. And this is oh the, like, I mean, the classic Missoni Chevron. Chevron. It is so nice. This knit feels phenomenal. Like, you can tell the difference. There's the Missoni for Target that has a cardigan that you will find at the thrift. It looks almost identical to this. Mm -hmm. But the colors are more bright and a little bit garish. Okay. These colors are very unique. The, the chartreuse with these, this kind of like green gray and mm -hmm. then the lavender, it's a very high end color palette to my eye. What did it sell for? Uh, it sold for $42. $42. Oh. You want to Folex the tag? I will. You know, <laughs> people love when I Folex the tag. Let me get my kit. <laughs> You're going to love it. Um, All right, we'll anyway, show you the before. Here's so the before. I think that the Amazoni stuff, if you can find it, it's still a really good pickup. There it is. And we've so also. Let's that a little. Oh my gosh, you guys are going to love this. Oh, We've schmutz. also sold Missoni before with flaws because sometimes the knit gets snagged yeah. and it still sells. Or you can get a snag nab it and fix it yourself. All right, here we go with the full legs. You can get this on Amazon. It's linked below, I think. Oh. Let me get over here. Okay, we're going to spray it. Yeah. You're gonna, And then we're going to bring it into view. After you spray it? Yeah. Well, I already showed them that before. I know, but uh, they want to see the, the inaction. The yeah, the during. All right. That's what they want to see. They're here for the during. This one's a little stubborn. A little bit. This one's a little bit stubborn. I have no idea if you guys see this. Mm, yes. As long as we stay right here. <laughs> oh, it is lifting. It's just taking a minute. See it coming off? Yeah, kind of. It's coming off on my Q-tip. Yep. Ew. <laughs> I mean, we did, pho I say this every time, we photographed it just like this, but yeah. it's nice to just send it over deliver, you know? <laughs> Ooh, I gotta get this big chunk up here. Okay. 
chunk. <laughs> that nice. comes right off it's so easy these little fixes are just so easy just takes a little bit of elbow grease much better look at that much better all right so much better here we go that's pretty i really like the color palette on that if I can do nothing else while you're watching these videos every day, most people watch every day, hint, hint, <laughs> um, is to make you love, fall in love with fashion. If I can do that, I've done my job. Because if you love what you're selling, reselling is so much more fun, right? For sure. If you get super excited about a lavender and chartreuse color palette, it's way more fun to list. And then you, you have a better title because you know what is exciting about it. And then people are more opt by yours because it'll look better in the photos everything about falling in love with fashion if you're a clothing reseller is good news nine ounces next is chico's All right chico's which i've been actually really surprised with the quality of chico's as well i i'm not sure that it's so far different than eileen fisher to be honest the quality is pretty good Chico's women's size one, US eight, teal open cardigan, and two piece set waterfall hint, uh, a and tank. It's a twofer. All right, I'm not going to unfold all of these because. it The cardigan looks just like Eileen Fisher, though. Like, yeah, here we go. I, I'm <laughs> telling you, if you took the tag out, I probably would call it Eileen Fisher if I, you know, was in a game show. Yeah. Look at it. It yeah. looks just like it. Do I have to clean the tag? Nope. <laughs> I mean, come, we've sold this exact thing from Eileen Fisher. Look at you this. You know what, though? The Eileen Fisher would, it, uh, I don't know, something about it would be slightly, it'd be heavier or something, or, but it's, yeah, it's super close. Super close. If you want the look of Eileen Fisher <laughs> in your life for half the cost, Chico's is where it's at. Yep. I'm, I'm. And I was just about to say, I mean, just based solely on the volume of it that we find, it's got to be popular. I mean, people are, have yes. to be buying it and wearing it in order to donate it so that it ends up at the thrift. Nothing yeah. about that felt low quality to me. No. Um, I can imagine Eileen Fisher using a silk blend. So maybe it would have been a little bit softer, but not... This is a dupe. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> let's call it what it is. Yeah. Some of these Chico's are Eileen Fisher dupes. They're clearly looking at Eileen Fisher, recreating the look, and selling <laughs> it for less. So if you are on a budget, this is your budget-friendly option. There you go. $27 it sold for. 12 ounces. That's, I think that's what we would sell that Eileen Fisher for. <laughs> okay, next is Ellie Tahari, which is a Tahari brand. Ellie Tahari sells for more. It's a higher end. This is the all the high-end stuff today. I don't know what's going on. This is a L.A. Tahari women's size medium blouse, purple silky drape cowl front top. Um, silky, it's not made of silk, so I knew I wasn't going to get a ton of money for this. It's a plain yep. purple silk top. I mean, silky. And this is how you get around that. This is made of polyester, but it feels silky. And so that's what I put in the title. It is not a silk top. <laughs> it sold for $20, and I priced it accordingly. If it was a silk top, we sold the same top maybe a week or two ago for $59.99. So you see where the fabric content makes the difference, but I didn't, you know, the cut is really nice. It's just, it's just polyester. Yeah. It doesn't breathe the same. So if you wore that under a suit and you were hot, like in a courtroom or something, I'm Ooh. imagining the lawyer, yeah. that polyester is not gonna give you the same flexibility that that silk would. That silk would breathe and you would have circulation. <laughs> <laughs> that thing's gonna trap in all your body heat. You're gonna be like, woo. Schwitzing. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, twenty dollars though, so that's great. Three ounces. Next, I just listed this. This is Janie and Jack, which is one of the only kids brands we list consistently. This is true. Janie and Jack, girls size ten. Don't think I didn't want to try it on because I did. <laughs> Blazer velvet eggplant purple two button formal. Now you think kids clothes? You can't get much for kids clothes. Except Janie and Jack. You yep. really, people, really can. People that love their Janie and Jack love it. This isn't even new attacks. It's yep. just like 
the did you notice there was an outlet of this at the outlet? I did. I saw that. Um, this sold for $28 yeah. in two days. Yeah. The formal wear does especially well for us. Super happy with that sale. 28 bucks for kids is good. That's really good. And I know we got this at the bins. Like, 100%. I Absolutely. get all JD yep. and Jack at the bins. <laughs> if it's there and it's not stained, I pick it up. Because, A, it's very lightweight normally. Well, this is velvet. It's not that lightweight. But a lot of it's really, really lightweight. And a lot of it is new with tags. I'm just like, what is going on? <laughs> and the t-shirt bros, they don't want... They definitely don't want it. JD and Jack. <laughs> and then the other ladies that are buying for the flea market. No one at my bins is buying kids clothes. Except me. 16. And Dan. Next is a chaser item. Chaser tank, women's size extra small, USA, graphic, red, white, tank top, burner, ringer, shirt. We've had this a long time, yeah, and we, we were just it. waiting for the right buyer, and they came along and purchased it for $26.95. Oh, this thing's super old. It's from half of half. Yeah, I still want to go to half of half, actually. Take a field trip over there. We haven't been in a long time, so maybe they've changed. There you go. And how much money? I'm supposed to tell you how much money we have into it. Uh, Two dollars and fifty cents. Two dollars and fifty cents, and that sold for twenty six ninety five. I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna tell you guys. My friend told me, "Hi Kim, hey, I'm Kim. shouting out Kim, my friend." She says I need to be better about telling you how much we paid, and I think she's right. So so far, the Eileen Fisher first cardigan that Ruth bought. Uh, we paid three fifty nine for it. It had a tiny flaw, and she purchased it for twenty eight. The Brioni jacket we paid four dollars for, and we sold it for two hundred and one dollars. The Max Mara weekend, the red button down shirt, we paid ninety nine cents for. That was from the bins, and we flipped that into thirty five dollars. Love it. The Anne Fontaine with its tiny flaw, the white crinkle shirt, we have three fifty nine into that, and we flipped it for thirty four ninety five. And then the M. Masoni cardigan, the knit with the chevron, that we have $1.99 into, and we were able to flip that for $42. The Janie and Jack uh, blazer, we have $0.99 cents into, and we flipped that for $28. The Ellie Tahari purple top that we just did, we paid $3.59 for that and flipped it into $20. So that one wasn't the best flip. I didn't check the material tag. I should have. Um, and then the Chico's teal cardigan and tank top, we paid three fifty nine for together, and it sold for twenty seven. Right. Next, Next, the chaser. Did you write down the weight of the? What is it? Chaser. No. Four. And how much do we have into it? Two dollars fifty cents. Two dollars and fifty cents, and we flipped it into twenty six ninety five. Yeah. Next is Eileen Fisher. From the bins. Eileen Fisher women's size medium red button front top dress shirt 100% cotton. Go. So this is Bins Fish. <laughs> Eileen Bisher. This. <laughs> Can't. It's close. It's close. Um, we bought this for nine. We we our cost of goods at the bins. We've been so many times. It's always about a dollar. So we just stopped counting and dividing and all of that. Sometimes it's a little less. Sometimes it's a little more. So this could have been 84 cents or a dollar and seven cents, okay? We just call it a dollar. So we have a dollar into this and we flipped it for twenty nine ninety five. It's good. Oh, it's going to Dallas. Oh, okay. If you are looking to get better about bin shopping, it might be in your interest to count and divide like how many items you got by the total to make sure you're making smart purchases once you've done it enough and yeah. some people's bins are way more expensive than ours ours That's are only a dollar 29 yeah. a pound and most things we you see we ship most things first class so most things are just under a pound and so that means they are about a dollar seven ounces like your bins might be different Okay, next is Anthropology Maeve, women's size small, Dora dress, red print, fit and flare. We have had this a very long time, I believe. Oh, yeah. uh, we gave it to April, and she took pictures, so it finally got listed. 
and it is another stretchy crinkle situation. Uh, the Mave tag is one of the lower of the Anthropology brands as far as resale goes. There you go. That one right there. But you can find it everywhere, right? Oh, like, yeah. Okay, so this is a shift dress because there's no waist seam. It's just a big rectangle. It is, I did call it fit and flare because it comes in a little bit here and then there's a lot more fabric at the bottom that flares out. And it's a really nice style to wear if you are heavier on the bottom, like me. It's really, really flattering, okay? Also, it's stretchy, so it can fit a multitude of sizes. It's got these little, these are casual sleeves. People ask me about sleeves all the time. These are just casual sleeves and then there's a back zip. So this is a great dress because you could wear it to work, you know, with a little blazer, or you could also wear it, you know, to like a Kenny Chesney concert with cowboy boots. <laughs> Whoa. The stylist that came out of nowhere. <laughs> anyway, it only sold for 15, but what did we pay for it? Uh, nothing. This was free. It was probably mine. I probably bought it at the thrift. So what happens is, I buy stuff at the thrift for ourselves, and then I put it in my closet to try on, and finally I'll get around to trying it on, like a year later, and then by that point it's free, because I have no idea where it came from. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. But I can see that as something I would buy, for all the reasons I mentioned. Sixteen. It's a heavy dress. You know yep. why? It's because it's got so much stretch in it. It's a lot of fabric. It's all put together. All right, next is Eileen Fisher. Oh, yeah. Women's size 1X organic linen blend cardigan sweater in gray green. This thing is very cool. This thing is amazing. I have never touched I just listed this, and it sold very quickly for $50. Yeah. I have never oh, listed an awesome. Eileen Fisher like this. April took the photos of this. It is so heavy. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to tell you about the fabric content. If it's here, it's not. But I looked it up because it, it it said nylon here, and I could see that it was like a little bit of nylon. And I just used Google Lens, and I put Eileen Fisher plus whatever, like 16% nylon, and then I found it. <laughs> I put open knit cardigan, you know. And this, I've never seen one like this. I know you're like Amy. You sell all of them like this. Yeah. No, this is different. It's super heavy. It's a double knit. Yeah. That means there's no knit and no pearl on either side. It's an open double knit, which is like, I don't even know how you do that. This thing weighs twice as much as the other cardigans that we normally sell for like 20 to 30. Yeah. This is different. And whoever's buying this knows that it's different. Uh, the, yeah, the gray green is the colorway from Eileen Fisher because the one that I found was new with tags. Oh, bonus. I know. I found one on Poshmark. I was so happy. And it looks like it was only made in plus sizes. So I hope whoever is, it's an organic linen blend. And um, it's a really, really nice piece. How much did we pay? Um, this is 99 cents. This is a Bins Eileen yes. Fisher again. And we flipped it for $50. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. I'm wondering if these high-end sales are coming from maybe tax refunds. Oh, could be. I mean, some people get a refund. We <laughs> did not. We owe so much money. Uh, we're just too honest. I think that's what it comes down to. Can you guys give us a thumbs up for our honesty with the government, please? <laughs> we're, like, prudishly honest. We just made a $5,000 payment today. Uh, and that's not paying it off. Okay. Of you have to pay taxes, though. I'm really the karma on it all. Pay your taxes, people. No matter what it is, whether you hit the $600 threshold or not, you still got to pay taxes. All right. All right. Padded flattering for that guy. The same day. So that one was called, was number 6967. And so I was listing this box that April had taken pictures of. And then this number is 6981. So it was in the same box. Yep. And it sold overnight as well. Oh, I remember finding these. Not Perfect is the brand. Not Perfect Women's Size Large Linen Pants Toledo Redwood Heavy Linen Loose Crop. This is what the tag looks like. I thought this was like an Amazon special because it looks a little shady. <laughs> no, it's just homemade. Yeah. There's a oh, there's a huge following for these, and the sell through rate is incredible. Yep. So sometimes the tag, it's just not mass produced, right? So that tag is like, 
Somebody made that tag, but it looked a little Amazon-y to me, if you know what I mean. Really? Yeah, look at it. It's kind of like, it, you know, I guess it's because the L was in a circle. And the, okay. The font, it just looked yeah. a little like, I buy a lot of clothes off Amazon for the, the TV movies and plays that I design for. And I have bought cool fanny that looks just <laughs> like yeah. that. And yeah. I was like, but the quality but, feels way better. It does. Uh, really nice pants. And they're a prop. They're just really slouchy and like cool. You know, you could wear these on the boardwalk. It would be like super cool. They sold for 40 bucks overnight. That's great. Boom, done. And we have $1 into them. They are also from the bins. Next and finally is Eileen Fisher. Hey! Eileen Fisher, size large, tunic, purple, short sleeve, viscose spandex, stretch, long top. And this sold for $49.95. You got 359 We have 359 It came from the van. Every time I say 359 it came from the van. <laughs> yeah. And I'll give you a van update today, too. You want a van update? I'm going to give it to you. There you go. It's gorgeous. Um, you're like, Amy, this is just a t-shirt. It is, but it's way nicer. It is. This, was, this is what makes it a tunic, ready? Because it can fit over your hips. So that means it's worn really long. It's tunic, and then the material tag on Eileen Fisher is right here in the bottom. That's where you want to look. Before you pay up for Eileen Fisher, please make me a promise. If you're at the thrift and you get excited because you found Eileen Fisher, look at the tag first. <laughs> and make sure it's got some really good fabric in it if you're going to pay like $10. We paid three fifty nine. This is viscose spandex. It's nothing special, but the cut is amazing, and I have never seen one like this. So that's why it went for forty nine ninety five. Cap. Sleeve. These are cap sleeves. Yeah. yeah, these are cap sleeves. This is a really nice dress it up, dress it down. Wear it with leggings. Wear it with jeans. Wear it with booties. You know what I mean? You could do it either. It's a good shirt. And um, but we would not. I would not have paid ten dollars for that shirt. Ooh. Right? If it was silk or if it was whatever, you know, I would have. And the perfect example was the pants we sold the other day that were cotton, and they went for 30 but the silk, the washable silk stretch crepe yep. pants go for 60 yep. So just really pay attention to your fabrics. I love that top. I love that color, too. if anything else sold oh come on <laughs> so we can add it in if anything did i just sent a big honking offer on poshmark wouldn't that be funny if that sold yeah all right uh 11 ounces for this last one ounces Let's see if anything i don't see anything on ebay do you oh mm, not on poshmark what i i thought i saw something but i didn't Okay. Still good. I feel really good about today's sales. Yeah. Starting off the month pretty strong. We're not selling like the highest, highest end, but we're selling a lot of quality pieces, which makes my heart just sing. so bad for hanging up on that lady. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, you ready? Yep. 
7840. Thank you, Ruth. Uh, 4639. Brioni. Six eight nine five. Seven seven three four. Six nine four four. <clears throat> Five one four nine. things on that street are pretty nice. Mm. Uh, 6518. Padded flat rate, 6967. Six nine eight one. And seven five five four. All right. This stuff's going to the post office and then we'll be back to talk about the profit. My bestie's over here making this video on the couch. You good girl picnic. Jeremy, you want to be in this video? Yes, you'll make an appearance. Oh. <clears throat> there he is. Say hi to your people. <laughs> All right. Bye. Okay, I just finished. I, I don't know. Oh, we don't know yet. I okay. don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so we're going to go to analytics. Oh, man, the suspense. We're going to go to today. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. $512 in profit, 767 This is a good gap. That is a good gap. It's not half. No. Uh, that happens when we sell a high dollar item, like the Brioni, for $200. 
that we only paid four dollars for it yes. this is what happens and this is where we want to be for sure what's that margin that's really nice it's it's nice yeah. <laughs> um 512 over 767 512 767 we're at yeah nice. yeah that's what i'm talking about 67 percent. that's really 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 good so um 47.98 at asp love it all right so for a month today this is the first day that we've done bookkeeping so yeah. we're at 512 dollars. ideally we'll be at 600 but it's early <coughs> in the day we still have time to make more sales and we'll just get caught up as we go yes we will pretty good start pretty great start guys thanks for hanging out with us we really really do appreciate it and we've got another channel that's linked down below we do live listing there monday through thursday nights 7 to 10 p.m central time come and hang out with us you Again. can also watch a replay yeah or do the replay like just go over there and subscribe to that channel because then if you need somebody to work with you during the day and we don't have a video or you already went through our video and you're still working we got another video for you there you go we come at you every day with two videos because we're crazy crazy bye, bye.